What up, how's it going? Matt Sweets here, and you are watching Shotgun Interviews. Talented. Show you bye. Show you bye is like the most bye. like slang that I know, you know? So I think that's the coolest. Dude, my grandpa teaching me all the crazy shit I know how to do. Like the reason I play Kendama is because he taught me piano, yo yo, unicycling, stilts. Like anything I wanted to learn, he was about teaching me and getting me the things I needed to learn it. And so that's why I do Kendama because he taught me so much crazy stuff. Inward still. Holy cow. I've been reliving a lot of them today. Like the 2014 Muso Tour, dude. It's hard not to say an MKO because I feel so proud of how big that's gotten too. Like this year was the coolest MKO I've ever been a part of. It's hard to say, man. Like it, all the big events are so nice. But like I'm proud of my event, but I'm also so stoked to be part of that first Muso Tour. That was legendary. Light. <laughs> it's a joint effort, but our accountant Nikki is like the one who's on it the most for sure. <laughs> mm, can seafood be my biggest turn off? Okay. Dude, I just hate it so much that like the smell of it makes me want to die. Anything that breathes water. <laughs> <laughs> It sucks being in Japan all the time with all this dang seafood, but like, never have liked it and never will. I oh, try man. every time and it's never good. My first tattoo is a cross on my arm for my grandma. I got it when I was 16 years old. My parents got it for me as my birthday present because she had just passed and I was really, really close to her. And they were cool enough to say yes. It was one of those things like I was like aiming for the fences, asking for it, and they said yes. And I was like, you for real? <laughs> And so, yeah, my first tat on my arm. I wanted to be a professional sports player, I guess. Like, I played every sport growing up, so soccer was something that I thought I was going to do forever. So, just like any other kid, snowboarding, skateboarding, that's why I started Sweets Kendamas and started the team immediately, because I saw it as, like, a skateboard, snowboard type of sport where we could be sponsored and travel the world. And here we are, in Japan, doing interviews. <laughs> Hajime. Oh. Oh.